I would like to show you how to capture ICMP Internet Control Message Protocol using the Wireshark. Firstly, you click the Wireshark, then you click the Electronic and click Start. Now, you search the command prompt. the pin and any url for example i'm using the url facebook and enter now you can see the destination reply from my request now just click the stop Type the SMP in the filter and enter. Now we can see the IP address upon the temp and destination IP address from Facebook. Thank you. Now I want to show you how we capture them as using Wireshark. So first of all, we need to open Wireshark and then click on wireless network connection. Open your CMD or command prompt. On this command prompt, you can ping to others' website. For example, I choose Facebook. And then you need to copy the IP address from this common prompt. Copy and paste to your browser. I use Google Chrome as my browser and paste here. Click enter. Now on Facebook show. And then back to Wireshark. And you type DNS. stop button packet filter change to string so facebook and then open back your command prompt type ip config you can see your ip address same as source that's all from me. Thank you. In this video, I want to show you guys how to capture FTP traffic in Wireshark. First of all, open Wireshark. Choose network interface. After that, open command form. Open as admin. In this command form, type FTP dot okay for you there tap anonymous for password tap password okay go to a shop stop capture and filter ftp as you can see, we already cache. We already capture FTP protocol. FTP protocol is a port 21. That's all for my video. I will show how to sniffing by using HTTP. First of all, click Wireshark. Choose Ethernet, then click Start. Then go to a new web browser. So you can choose any web browser, for example Facebook or any anything else. But I will choose IPO. I click IPO. So insert your ID user and your password. 
to the web we'll show the interface then we go back to Wireshark and click stop and add the filter we start HTTP then click button find a packet then choose string then choose packet part and add the filter type log then click find so at the Wireshark, we we'll show the packet data that we show user ID and the password same slot at the web browser. So that's all for me. Thank you. Stay tuned. Now I would like to show you guys about how to capture SMTP protocol using Wireshark. First, you need to open Wireshark. Then choose the Microsoft Wireless Network Connection. After that, go to the search and type CMD or Common Prompt. Click on it, open it. Okay, now as we can see that T is the Common Prompt. Now type Telnet. CD. Gmail. Dot com. Seven and click enter. Then type hello. You can see that the server is fly back to us. Then wait. Close the common prompt and we go back to the Wysha. Okay, Wysha. Uh, and the display filter we type SMTP. Click enter. Okay, and here we can see that the Wireshark already captured the SMTP protocol and the SMTP protocol used port 5.7. That's all from me. Thank you.